Just keep going and don't look back And look forward from where you're at There's some jealousy in your rear view Wave hello, hello, hello Push that pedal to the For grew up in Philadelphia, PA And is a product of the Philadelphia public school system He's a dynamic, inspirational, and motivational speaker Who has Dream. And I know you may be saying, well, wait a minute, brother, what's wrong with a dream? Because see, a dream is great. A dream is, you know, what you want to accomplish in life. But what I'm talking about today is having character. And having character is based on who you are, not just what you have. You ever see some of these athletes, and I'm not picking on them, but they're, they're just prevalent in society, who fall from grace, if you will, from time to time? They have a dream, and they've achieved it. I looked at this article just when I was coming here today. I was reading it on my phone. It said LeBron James says he's underpaid. Wow. He says he's underpaid. $17.4 million. Brother, get out of my face. Amen. But my point is, you'll get people in positions like that, they'll have success. Amen. And I'm not blaming or, 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 or you're hating on LeBron, Go ahead. Go ahead. but it's the level of his character you have to question. Brian. If you're making $17.4 million, talking about you underpaid, Great and they're going to complain about that. This is a life choice question. We shouldn't look at it as if we just want to be recognized for what we do. Because just like, remember when you were in school, teacher would take roll, they call your name Johnny here, Jamie here, Wesley here, Phil here, right? Teacher would call your name just to see if you were there, right? But see, when you have character, people don't have to call your name to know that you were here. If you have character, what will happen is that your work and your actions will speak for you even when you're not there. Wow, really. They'll know because the foundation that you've laid on can be built upon. Mm -hmm. They'll know because they'll see the positive change that you've impacted in people's lives. They'll know because they'll see the difference in your family and in your community. They'll know that you were there. You go on 65th Avenue where I live at, they're going to know, you will know that Jeff was there. Amen. You're going to walk in, and I'm not bragging, but you're going to know like, oh, this is the block Jeff lives on. Mm -hmm. I can tell. Amen. I can tell. That's when we know that our integrity is in line with our character, when we can stand in the midst of adversity. Yes. Yes. And we can do that. Yes. And that's what Joseph did. See, every time you stand, gives you strength for the next battle. Right. Standing today gives you strength for that battle next week. Standing next week gives you strength for that battle next month. Standing next month gives you that strength for that battle next year. Every time you stand, gives you strength for that next battle.